Hello, I'd like to further add to my last video bits and bobs I forgot to mention because I'm always in a hurry and rushing around here and there. In fact, once I've finished doing this video, I've got to go and do something else. I'm not quite sure when I'll upload it. It's about um, 10 to 7 uh, Thursday night at the moment. Uh, so when I'll upload it later on, I don't know. But I've got things to do. You see, I'm always in a hurry. But anyway, I have a life to live as well as politics. I'm making videos. But anyway, Nick Griffin talks about a long war for culture, community and physical uh, survival. Okay. So we fight for the community, but we don't represent the community on the council. We leave that to Labour. That doesn't make sense, especially when we can win these council seats. No problem. Burnley, Blackburn, Oldham, Halifax, all over the country. We can win council seats there, and you know we can. So let's fight for the community, but not represent it on the council. Leave that to Labour. That doesn't make sense. And like I've said, we should be riding high now with... Uh, dozens and dozens of wins on the 2nd of May, right? We should be riding high, expecting dozens of council wins, but we're not. We're rock bottom, when in fact the conditions are such for us in this country like now, like never before. Yes, we're rock bottom. That doesn't make sense either. Well, we know why we're rock bottom, right? Because bogus nationalism has replaced genuine nationalism. That's what's happened, right? We should be riding high, but we're not. And we know why we're not, and so do you, Nick. You know why we're not. And all this nonsense you're coming out with after just speaking to a veteran nationalist, it's not a cop out. You know what he said to me? It's a con, because you know it's a con. All this long war for the fight for, for community, culture, uh, physical survival. It's a load of nonsense. The public's not ideologically driven like that. The masses don't think like that. They just want food and money on the table. That's what they want. They're not interested in culture. Yes, I'm sure, you know, if you sat them down, they'd agree with you on this, that and the other. Uh, you know, but the main, their main concerns of a, of a day is putting food and money on the table you know it is culture and everything else and tradition come second let alone asking them to embark on a long war for culture community and physical survival it's a war that it's it's just utter nonsense or oh, people would not be up for any such endeavor if that's the right word so there's just i just wanted to clear up a few things here because i didn't really get enough out and like i've said fight for community but don't represent them on the council leave that up to labor that doesn't make sense let's fight for community and represent them on the council that sounds a lot better doesn't it okay thank you